Now let's take a look to see if our function f of x equals square root of x has any relative maximums or minimums. If you recall, a relative maximum is just a high point relative to the rest of the graph. And a high point would just look like the top of a hill. And as you can see, if we look at our function, that there are no high points, no hilltops, if you will. And so the relative maximums do not exist for f of x equals square root of x. And then if you wanted to talk about a relative minimum, think of the low point of a valley. So like this point here, do we have any valleys on our function? And we can see that we do not. And so there are no relative minimums. So we would say those are not applicable. So that concludes our observations in regards to the characteristics of a square root function.